You know, I would have beaten you. What? Earlier. If Atreus hadn't been there. Hmm. Perhaps. We could go again. Find out for certain. I would rather not. I'll bet you wouldn't. Waterfalls. We're close. There should be a gate up ahead. That's quite a gate. Don't suppose you know a way through? The Pilgrim Gate. I can open it. We just need to find the right vantage point. Freya, there's something I've always wanted to ask. What was it Grimthur whispered to you? Who? Grimthur, the son of Thormur, the stonemason, who disguised himself and built Asgard's wall. Oh, yes. One of the many occasions Odin saw fit to involve me in a wager without my consent. I wish I could say that was the worst of his husbandly habits. What wager? I've told this story, brother. And now she may tell her own. There isn't that much to tell. I knew nothing of it at first, surely because Odin didn't expect to lose the bet. A mysterious mason had to build the entire wall in three turns of the season. Two! It was two! And if he was late, he'd be owed nothing. But if he succeeded, he was promised an audience with the queen. Or so I learned one day when Odin burst into our bedchambers, raging and half drunk before noon, telling me to get dressed and go see what the mason ah, you was. You bought some of my armor! Ah, but enough I'll of that for now. I'll you real good! We sure appreciate you finding my orb, though. I am doing this for free and whatnot. Learn anything? can forge some new stuff for you. Despite his actions in Midgard, Atreus does still care for you. I know. I raised a son, too. It may be hard to believe, but he was quite similar to Atreus at this age. He adored his father, always wanted to do right by him, and was constantly frustrated that no matter what he did, he never could seem to get his approval. He confided in me a lot. prepare for a fight. Alpha! Enjoy! Yeah. Above you! Uh -huh. ah. Mm-hmm. <laughs> 
Looks like more of Lunda's old armor. Nearly have the complete set now. What is wrong? I died. And you will help me. Of course, Gunhild. But to what end? When the Ain Heriar came, we needed a way to fight back. I suggested. Say them. I understand your desperation, but that was foolish. Clearly. I was lucky enough to be murdered before my mind could be corrupted. As theirs did. You must free them. Of course. Say their magic corrupts so ruthlessly. Those poor souls must be in agony. Then we shall give them death. Friends' souls are still twisted, aren't they? Now, how do we get up there, I wonder? The we can't. Not with those vines in the way. Doesn't look like we can reach it from down here. Nothing, brother. Just. Do you ever have those moments where you wish you could go back, rewrite your own past, make 
different decisions. Journeying through time is more trouble than it is worth. Ah, fair point. You're speaking metaphorically, right? No. Of course you're not. Freya, can we return to your story of Finthur? You said if he built Asgard's wall in time, he was promised an audience with you. Yes, and built it he did. So, off I went, not knowing what had truly been promised or expected. Dagger stashed in my robe for emergency. And this mason, this giant in disguise. His name was Finthur. He just smiled to see me. And as you said, he whispered in my ear. He said the Aesir had killed his father, and he needed to know that one day they'd burn for it. I pointed out I was Aesir now, too, technically. He gave me a look, Happy as if he somehow knew better armor and continued. Hey, um, we'll just stop there for now. Enough. We will continue later. Before you see the lad again, might we discuss an approach? He will tell me where he has been. That is my approach. Ah, classic Spartan diplomacy. Wait. Did you say Odin invited him to Asgard, and then he disappeared for two days? Aye. But surely the lad's got more sense than to... Don't underestimate Odin's powers of persuasion. He filled my son's head with lies. Why wouldn't he do the same with yours? Hmm. Sucker, he owes me one. Thank me now and eternally. Well, looky there. Glad you can make the trip, your goddessness. I put your sigil magic on the young turd's bow. But then he and Sindri got into it over something. Mm. Atreus. Well, come on then. Hey, Tyr! Wake up! You got company. Now, why don't you just make yourself at home in Sindri's so-called study over yonder? You're sure he won't mind? Mind? But you are gone for... You better screw his head back on. And I mean tightly. So you're back. Are you ready to answer me? About what? Where did you go? Who did you see? Was it Odin? What? Is that what you think? Do you deny it? <laughs> Answer me! Did you go to Asgard? No! Of course not! But so what if I did? It's my future, it's my life! You are my son! Then why don't you trust me? If you want me to trust you, then tell me the truth! The truth is you're being a complete asshole! Laddie, you know that's no way to change a man's mind! He doesn't have any faith in me! It's fine if he keeps secrets. It's fine if Mom did. It is not fine. Her secrets haunt every step of this path. Oh, okay. So you don't believe in her anymore either? This is not about your mother. What you have done is lie. Wonder where I learned that. That's quite enough. Since when do you always take his side? Since he became the one making sense. Look, I was only thinking about going to Odin. But I swear it's for a good reason. There is no good reason to go to Odin. He'll only cloud your mind. But I'd be going for us. I, I gotta stop something bad from happening. Something bad did happen. Look at me, at Freya, at Tia. Odin did this to us. What's got everyone caterwauling all of a sudden? Atreus wants to go to Asgard. Asgard? Get kicked in the head or something? Great, I guess everybody's against me now. 
You must choose who you are going to be. Are you going to continue to lie and keep things from me? Or are you my son? Choose? I never get to choose. Just leave me alone. Listen. Let go of me. Listen. Listen. Let go. What the fuck? I can't. It's Sindri. Just, just try to keep control. Definitely in Midgard. Keep it coming. You're just helping me stay warm. These things! When did it get so bad out here? Jump up! <sighs> Gotta find some shelter. At least something out here doesn't want to kill me. You just need someplace warm. Then I can figure out where to go next. Uh, that doesn't look good. What is this thing? Some kind of white? What is it you want? Trying to tell me something? First, he thinks I've been to Asgard. Then, line. Ah! I'm trying to save your life, you big jerk. Yeah! <laughs> 
I find shelter and then what? Where could I go? If I go to Asgard, following the prophecy where Father ends up dead, if I stay locked up at home, there's nothing I can do to stop it. I guess in Asgard, I could at least keep an eye on Odin. Be a spy. Find out his plan. Take control of this. Oh, who am I kidding? I can't go to Asgard. Wait, are those red leaves? Freya's house. Charlie! No. Charlie! Please. Please! Charlie! Stand to let me into that house. Think you can do that? Come on, Charlie. You have to do this. I... I can't help if you don't... Emily! Emily! Buddy, I know. It's cold in here. <sighs> I should close that window before snooping around. Freya hasn't been checking on you? Right. Too busy hunting us down. Come on. Let's get you warmed up. Should be able to make a fire from all this mess. Wow, it's beautiful. Never seen anything like this around here before. From around in Vanaheim? She must have really missed it. I can't believe she never came back to check on her house. To check on you. That's not an excuse. Okay, buddy. I think he's here for me. I'll be okay. I think. Ah. 
Okay. I'm ready. Take me to him. Should have learned to swim before Midgard froze over. Hello? I'm here. Odin? Bert, is this Asgard? Hey, wait up! The wall! This is Asgard. Hold on, I'm coming. You don't see friendly. Hey, Odin! I thought you said I was welcome in Asgard. Could have led me around those. be the craziest thing I've ever done. But if that's what it takes to change father's fate. Hey, Bird! Where'd you go? Hold on! I'm coming! Just gotta find a way through. 
Okay, now which way? Everything I came to Asgard for is on the other side of that wall. There you are! What am I gonna say to Odin? Uh, hi. I came to be your apprentice, I guess. But it doesn't mean I, like, serve you now. Not in a foretold by prophecy. <laughs> That it's safe from the other side of that wall. Wait, how do I get past the wall? I never came up with a mere story about Hrimthur. The stonemason's son built a flaw into it. He only told Frey about it, and I didn't think to ask. Hold on, I was Frey at the house. Did she move in with us? You know what? Focus, Loki. Father would just burn this away with his blades. But what can I do? Yeah. Huh. Maybe that sigil magic on my bow can help. What does Brock say? If I could just get that fire to spread to the bramble. No way up from here. I better figure a way through that bramble. <laughs> there we go. Hey. 
Wait, that sounds like people. You need help? You, uh, you look a little lost. Oh, uh, I'm just getting my bangs. Well, there's nothing to see this way except the big wall. Is there a gate to go through? <sighs> nope. Not unless you're an Aesir god, but I guess you'd know that if you were an Aesir god. Me? No. I'm from Midgard. What? No shit. Me too. I'm skilled here. Lucky. Hang on. Are you all from Midgard? <laughs> yep. The, uh, All Father saved us from the desolation, gave us a safe place to settle, but we don't go in there. Can't get into the city unless you know magic. You, you don't know magic, do you? A little bit, yeah. What? No shit. You, can you walk through walls? Not yet. Couldn't I just climb over it? <laughs> that? Without any gear? Uh, no. Aren't you afraid of dying? Well, yeah. I mean, look at that. But, Odin awaits. Wait, you know the Allfather? I'm sort of his apprentice. No shit! What is he teaching you? I'm not sure. Well, how many other students? I don't know. How long you stayed? You don't know. Okay. I'm gonna go climb that wall now. Well, this I gotta see. You need help? I appreciate it, but I gotta go alone. Oh, I wasn't gonna climb with you. I may owe Odin my life, but I don't owe him my death. Not that I think you're gonna fall. Forget I said anything. Is that Hugin? Is Hugin your guide? Who? Odin's Raven. You know, from Hugin the Moonin. He's a pretty good guy. Though, not sure he'll know too much about climbing. Well, Loki, you seem like a good guy. I really hope I am not about to watch you die. Thanks. Me too. I, you know not to look down, right? I like looking down. It shows me how much progress I've made. Wow. Yeah, that's great. Can I use that? I mean, a little ironic, last words, but... What was that? Nothing. Nothing. Hey, you're doing great. Thanks, Gilder. Hope you're right. Okay, I can do this. This is fine. Just keep climbing. And now where? Hey, Hoogan. Don't suppose you'd like to pass the time by telling a story, would ya? Yeah, that's what I thought you'd say. A wife? Up here? Malcolm!
Yeah, I'm coming. Let's get that chain down. Yeah, I wonder why I can't hear your thoughts. Sure seemed like Odin could. That was you in our cabin, right? You and your brother, I guess? Taking that for a yes. Breathe. And... Yes! I bet I'm past the worst of it now. Or not. Uh, wanna just let me pass through? No? Have it your way. Hello. Oh, Get it. Whoa. Okay. These are connected. Yeah, that makes sense. I think. Gotta do both sides though. to fly. I'm doing what I can. Huh. Don't see any more shortcuts. Just gotta climb a little further. Maybe a lot further. But I've come this far. Hey, Hugin. How about I tell you a story? Once, there was a giant named Loki, who thought it'd be a good idea to accept Odin's invitation to Asgard. So, Odin tested Loki, expecting him to climb, by himself, all the way up Hrimthor's wall. So, what did Loki... So what did Loki do? He kept climbing. He just kept climbing. His arms hurt. His fingers went numb. It got hard to breathe. But Loki kept climbing. One foothold at a time. All the way to the top.
Nowhere to go but up. Okay, okay. Keep going. Come on. Can't stop now. Come on! Okay. I can do this. I can do this. Almost there. Hello. Uh, hi. So, what part of the enormous wall made you think, oh, visitors must be welcome? I was sent for, actually, by Odin. The Allfather sent for you. <laughs> Great. And then why are you out there, and not in here? Why don't we ask them together? Hmm. Ah! Oh! Are you finished? Now, what could Odin, Allfather, King of the Aesir, possibly want with the likes of you. That's between me and Odin. You don't even know, do you? <laughs> think you could pull me up, or...? <sighs> no, I don't think I will. I think maybe I'll drop you. No. No, 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 no. no. Yes, I'm Stop. going to drop you. Goodbye. Stop. Where? Think how mad the Allfather's gonna be when, when he finds out you killed his guest. Loki of the Jotnar? <laughs> the Jotnar. Enemy of my people. I am not your enemy. I will be the judge of that. <laughs> this way, Loki of the Jotnar. Wait, is that Gellerhorn? Are you Hondo? Obviously. Now feel free to drink in the splendor of Asgard. This is a rare sight for outsiders. Especially giants. Yes. Why not steal anything that is not nailed down? That is sure to impress your hosts. <sighs> Just ask your questions already. How do you know I had questions? It is my job. Next question. What is your job? I protect the realm I love from trouble. And you think I'm trouble? You just met me. And I can already see you are eager to prove yourself. Way too eager. Probably due to an overshadowing father figure you can never live up to. Good guess. I would also guess that you are... disrespectful. Entitled and... impulsive. You don't know me at all. I help people. Oh! You are here to help people. Hmm. No. No. You are here to help yourself. To manipulate and lie to whoever you have to to get what you want. I know you're young. Your voice probably dropped while you were climbing the wall, but... <laughs> what a twisted little soul you have. <laughs> you are chaos in a spiffy archer suit. I watch your mouth move, and I see cities burning. 
good is going to come from you being in Asgard. That said, if you are here to aid the Allfather and have no treacherous intent, I guess that makes us allies. Ghoul Topper. Who loves me the most? Who loves me the most? Wow, that's almost as impressive as Balder taming a dragon. Balder had the luxury of not caring how badly he got burned. I outthink them. Dominate them fair and square. These all Aesir gods? What? You think all Aesir are gods? But Skilder told me that oh, only. Well, if Skilder told you, clearly whoever that is must be the authority on Aesir gods, not the Aesir god you are currently talking to. You literally know nothing of our culture, do you? I know lots of things. I know a giant built that wall. A giant built the wall that keeps out the giants. Primther, son of Thamur. I know the whole story. Really? I truly cannot wait for you to regale me with the revisionist tales of Asgard's architectural history. Is that Odin's palace? Palace? Do you think the Allfather needs to puff himself up like some mortal chieftain? I guess not. That is the Great Lodge which the All-Father built with his own hands. I'm sorry if that is a letdown for you. Real power, you see, does not need to flaunt. It emerges when the time is right. Don't you agree? Ah! Hey! Whoa! Ah! Hey! Helmets! I brought you a practice down. I thought we were going to own it. You see, the thing is, you do treacherous and So I am not letting you anywhere near the Allfather. Ah, good boy. That is what he deserves. Oh, very nice. The moves that he has. It is a wonder that the Yotar lost every war they ever fought. Come on, Loki. Let's see what you've got. Well, that was boring. Guess who's next? You sure you want to keep up other waiting? Funny thing. I am sure about that. Yes, I am feeling very sure, matter of fact. <laughs> oh no! Arrows! How fearsome! Whoa! Whoa! How is he doing that? <laughs> oh. Oh. You're not gonna stop me from seeing Odin! <laughs> 